and oh we're not doing an and we're back we're doing it's a wally jolly christmas it's a wally jolly christmas <laughs> it's a wally, wally jolly, jolly christmas and today we thought it'd be super fun to share with you some of our favorite preschool hey. learning mm -hmm. toys and all of these items yeah. we're going to show you today are still available yeah. to purchase before the holidays so yeah. you can still have them under your tree yeah. for christmas morning and we'll link everything down yeah. below yeah. with the amazon links but they're also available at like Walmart and Target and all of those places as well. So let's get started showing you all of our favorite preschool toys. As a mom with a four-year-old, it's really important to me that we find lots of fun toys to play with, but also toys where he has the opportunity to learn and be hands-on with his learning. So these are some of the favorite things that I found over the last like year, um, just looking for fun ways for him to learn and play. And we're gonna start with this one. This is the Coding Critters Learning Resources Coney Critters, and it's this cute little puppy dog, and it's for ages four and up and it is a STEM toy. So you can hear Wally's playing with it already. Um, but this is a super fun way to introduce the concept of coding and storytelling and just fun hands-on play. So let's just show you some of the fun things that you can do with this. All right, so the first thing is that it comes with this cute little coding book that's a nice little story that you can go through. And it has two characters. It has Ranger, which is the main big puppy that you can code, and his little puppy friend, Zip. It also comes with this super fun slide and a ball and his dog house. So you can go through this adventure, this whole little storybook, and it tells you all the fun things that Zip's gonna do on his day of adventures and how you're gonna code him along the way to do all these different challenges and interact with his friends. So this is a super cute way to do this and an easy way to kind of introduce it. Wally and I had a lot of fun doing this when we very first got it. Um, and now we like to do some other challenges with it as well. So I'll show you some of the other things that it comes with. All right, so here's some of the fun accessories that it comes with. He's got his little doghouse and his bone, little fire hydrant and a little tree. There's his friend Zip who comes down the slide. It also has this cute little seesaw and a ball. And then it comes with all of these tiles in it as well. So you can lay these down and kind of do some challenges. <laughs> and they do magnetize together, which is super, super cute. All right, Wally, do you think we could get Ranger to go into his doghouse? I want to go in his doghouse. Do you think we can get Zip and Ranger to go in their doghouse? Yeah. Okay, so let's set them up here, and there's their doghouse. How do you think he's gonna get there? One, two. Ooh, almost. Look at, there he goes, he goes to his doghouse, and now he can enjoy his bone with his friend. Hmm, that's so fun, buddy. All right, a ranger has two modes. So right now he's in his coding mode, which we can tell because the light's off, but if we hold in his nose, this light comes on. And now he's in play mode. So now he can do all sorts of fun things. We can feed him, we can pet him, we can let him take a nap, and he can even do a dance party. You wanna put him in dance party mode, Wally? <laughs> it's a little crazy when he's in dance mode. Come back, Ranger! He'll also do a patrol, won't he? <laughs> he's keeping us safe. Okay, Ranger, time to take a nap. All right, well that is the coding critter puppy, little ranger there, super cute. I'll make sure and link this down below. It looks like these are actually on sale for $25.99 on Amazon right now, which is a great deal, because they're normally 40 bucks, and they have it in a couple other ones. It looks like they also have a bunny, and a dinosaur, and a kitty. So whatever your kid is into, super fun, would highly recommend, great way to introduce coding. <laughs> While he's checking it out, now I think he wants that another one. one. <laughs> that one, I want, I want that one, and that one, and I want This is how it goes every time I get on Amazon. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's show you another fun toy that we like to learn with. Okay, well now, yeah. Wally and Daddy are going to work on the Osmo Learning Pad. Yeah, then open it. Let's open it. And Wally, what do you like about the Osmo? Um, I, I like 
worried about it is we got to do any way it actually Yes, because it, it kind of like guides you through. So it's a great tool um, to allow Wally to play with his iPad, which he loves to do, but have it be in an educational setting. So it says it's for ages three to five, which I think is exactly yeah, correct. And, it is and my promotes pre-reading, yeah. storytelling, and Do fine you know motor skill development. Yes, those go for your iPad. Yeah, yeah. If we don't have these, then it will go on. No, and so you don't need to get this kit specifically, but yeah. you do need you do need at least one kit that has the one. mirror that goes at the top that kind of gives away how it works, and the base that gets yeah. everything into alignment. Yeah. But yeah. you'll see us. It, you can yeah, buy multiple do, different yeah. add-ons to it. it um, yeah. I want to tell them, Kelly. Okay. Yeah. If you not have it, then in the game not will work. Nope, doesn't work, does it? No. Games are free to download on the yeah. iPad, you but you do need the can, kit you to only make it can, work. You only can work. They only can work with this mm -hmm. and this. And there's some drawing games that Osmo does sell a and, whiteboard that you can get. And this get. is my iPad. That is your iPad, yep. We'll need to take it out of the container. It has yeah, to be free form. Uh, there are some games that require a whiteboard, and Osmo does sell one if you want to get the official Osmo whiteboard, but we found this dollar bin whiteboard works just fine. So it does, the, the base that it comes with has this channel. If you need to plug in your iPad, you could. Ours is at full power, so we don't need to waste time plugging it in. And you can see Wally has already installed the top piece, the mirror that makes it work. Right. Go to go like that. We're going to do stories first, is what Wally wants to do first. Osmo stories. What? Tap the story you want to play. Which story do you want to play? Ooh, that's one of my favorites. Oh, look at that old oil lamp. It's pretty dirty. It's covered in dust. So it's really cool Maybe as Wally put the clothes lamp. on here. It instantly transforms and the image. And then we can do rotate it. Wait, rotate and then do boop boop. There you yeah. go. Find something to either pay the gatekeeper or open the gate. Pay? I don't, I can't find anything to pay. Oh, there's a key, yep. There you go. Choose a useful cup. Yeah. Tap the key. Good job, buddy. I wouldn't the pay my can ball open the gate. Yeah. Round peg, round hole, it fits. You may pass. Welcome to the land beyond the gate. Ready to make Okay, my so now. Magical? Wally wants to do, do, you want to do A, B, C's. There you go. That's a big C. When you're done making the letter, tap here. Stand back and hands off. Okay, be ready. Magic time. Here's what you made. Wow, that letter is absolutely perfect. Good job, buddy. I'm impressed. So it uses the camera to look down at the One of my favorite words board to see what he has done. Ah, uh, the letter M. M. Ooh. Do you think you can make can that you letter? Make this letter? First, place this piece down. Like that? See, look at that. Stand back and cross Stand your back. fingers. Abracadabra. Here's what you made. M is for mailbox let's make the sound for m it sounds what like what does an m sound like what does an m sound like mailbox one thing i do like about osmo is it does afford him some creativity and he does pay attention when it actually wants him to and then every so often like right now he's just going to be a little bit creative and and osmo's okay with that All right, so now we're going to do the monster creative one. I can't wait to see what my new room will look like. Oh. To start, let's add a little color to the walls. 
Could you clear the board and draw a cloud? Draw a cloud. Hey, that's a pretty nice cloud, oh, buddy. Thanks! This looks fantastic! There we go. Alright, draw a picture of him. Proper shape, good lines, this will do nicely. All right, buddy. As you can see, the Osmo kit has a ton of different things for the little ones to do. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, and I do it at It's asking me to do. You drawing you? That's a good picture of you, buddy. That's a great picture of you. So this little genius starter kit, link down below, it's on Amazon today, it's 20% off, $64. And you can still get it in time for Christmas. Yeah. Let's try something else. We play with Monday, you draw the bell in number 10, or D died, or then it's yeah. balance. Wally, what is the name of this? This is called Monkey Balance. Yeah. This is another STEM toy. For kiddos, and what are you trying to do? Hold on, what are you trying to do? Are you are you counting these? Yeah. What number is over here? Ten. Ten. So how many monkeys do you think need to go on this side to balance the one. ten? There's one. Two. You count. No, you count. No, you I. You count. I, you put I, the monkeys on I, and count. I put them. You. Daddy knows how to count. What is that? Three. Three. Four. Four. Five. Ten. Six. Seven, eight, nine. nine. Whoops! Slow down. Oh, hold. Nine. Ten. Ten. That's ten. And we add a two on there. How many more monkeys do you need to put over here? How many? One. One. Two. Two. And those monkeys are in balance. How many? Oh, yeah. you put four in there now. Okay, put how many monkeys are you gonna need in there? One, two. Three, four. And this comes with some really cool flashcards that give you a bunch of different things to do. So let's try one, buddy. Okay. So now we're gonna try this flashcard where one. you can see there's three monkeys plus four monkeys. All right, so let's do it. One. Seven, two. Two. Three. three. All right, so you did the three. Now let's do plus four. One, two, three, four. All right. How many monkeys is that now? What? Which one of these numbers do you think balances that out? Are they in balance? So Wally, three monkeys plus four monkeys is seven. Seven. Three monkeys plus four monkeys is seven. Ten. Yep. Ten is a big number. Ten is a big number. It's heavy, isn't it? Ten! What? It's raining it all down. What's really cool about this set is that there's different levels of card based upon where your child is at or the activity you're wanting to do with them. So this green level is for number recognition, kind of like what we're doing now where you have two and two monkeys. You also have purple, which helps with counting. And then the ones we were doing before, the blue, which are addition. So Monkey Balance, another game, another STEM game, available on Amazon for $19.99. It's $2 off right now, and you can see it knows your address, and it will tell you, arrives before Christmas. So make sure you see that arrives before Christmas, and you know you're going to get it in time to have under the tree for Christmas. Wally, do you enjoy the monkey balance game? And I not draw the one in Tinder. You don't know, we, we already have it. We already have it. We're telling our friends these are things they can get if they still need some ideas for Christmas. Yeah. And look at here, you put five monkeys over here to match your five. This monkey is in balance. Now I typed it. Ooh. Now we typed it. Are you gonna it. do six? Okay. One. That's it. Now Yay. it's in balance. All right, the last one we want to show you guys today 
is our alphabet acorns and this is another learning resource toy and it's great for doing letter recognition and alphabet i love that it has uppercase and lowercase and every acorn has a surprise inside yeah. so let's get this out and yeah. play with it all right, so I chose to keep the container and we do put them all back in there. It's kind of a fun way to put all the letters in order when we're all done. All right, well, I pick one of the letters. W. W, okay. Uh, let me tell you. Yeah, so what's inside a of it? Anytime you open these, there's one little part in it. Oh my goodness, like what a, is that? Like a whale. Like a whale. Because oh. whale starts with the letter W. What? And these are so nice I because don't know this one. they have the capital letter here. And then when you take the lid off, the lid has the lowercase letter. So you can do um, capital know. and lowercase letter recognition. And uh, you can start to talk go. about words and what they start with. I don't with. know what that one is. Okay, what's that one? What's in there? A leaf. A leaf. Okay. So leaf, Wally. Leaf starts with the letter L. 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 Yep. Leaf no. starts with the letter L. It's the first letter of the alphabet, Wally. Um, a. a. What's inside that A acorn? It's an apple! <laughs> Is it yummy? <laughs> Alright, put your apple back in and let's look at There's A, big A, Wally, and there's uh, A, little A. Uh, little Say a. big A, little A. Big A, little A. Good job. All right, so another fun thing you can do, and this is a little advanced for him yet, but he's gonna grow into this. We can make different words. Okay, so we've got our F, our U, and our N. Wally, do you know what word that is? F and U and N. Is fun. 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 So you can one actually one. spell out some different words too, which one. is super fun. Or, Wally, let's show him another way we can do that. You can also stack them up, which is super. Yeah. Fun. fun, yeah. All right, Wally and I are gonna play a super fun game called Alphabet Pile Up. Yay. Okay, go ahead. Yep. What is this, Wally? Do you know xylophone. what that is? A xylophone. Do you see the letter X? <laughs> it's a blue one. Yep. Good job. <laughs> good job. Okay, let's try another one. What's this, Wally? Train. A train. <laughs> and train starts with the letter T. <laughs> do you see the letter T over here, <laughs> Wally? Do you see the letter T <laughs> over here? Yeah. That's Y. One. One. That one's F. One. That one's T. T. Good job. Can you find something that starts with the letter H? Maybe a hippo? <laughs> hippo. And it's the very last letter of the alphabet, which is the letter Z, Z for? What is Z? Uh, I do know. Zebra? Zebra. Zebra. Z for zebra. All right, Wally, I've got one more game. Are you ready? This is with our lowercase and our uppercase letters. So, do you see this? This is a lowercase s. Do you see something that looks like the big S? <gasps> Good job! All right, how about W? Yep, yeah, good job. And H. H is hard. What do you it? see which one matches it? Good job! I don't want it to work. You did, and the what? last one is the letter J, do you see Big J? <gasps> Good job. I want to go back. Good job, high five. All right, and then when we're all done, we put all of our acorns back in, and then what do we do, Wally? I'm taking the elder. Okay, you ready? <gasps> ready? This time to work with the towel. It does, okay, are you ready? Uh, a, B, C, D, E, F, D, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. Good job, buddy. Now Wally knows his ABCs. Next time, won't you eat acorns with me? All right, so this is the alphabet acorns, and you can get this one on Amazon right now. It looks like it's on sale for $16.39, which is yeah. a pretty good price. So I'll link yeah. this one down below and for you as well. Yeah. Make sure you check these out. Yeah. And all of these leaning, learning resource toys, they yeah. also have at Target. So yeah. I always do price checking between Target and Amazon yeah, to see who has the better price. But make sure you check yeah. it out. And all of these yeah, are still yeah, available yeah. to be delivered by Christmas Day, which is awesome. And you can also sign up for a free Amazon Prime trial right now. So that's awesome because that means for sure with Prime, you can get it by Christmas. 
All right, well, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully this was fun to see some of our favorite preschool learning toys. If you have a little one at home that you're working with to learn counting and ABCs and STEM all those activities. things, these are some great toys to have fun with to get you there. So make sure you check out all the links down below in the description and don't be afraid to price shop around. Like I said, both Target and Amazon usually have all the learning resource toys and sometimes Target has better pricing, but Amazon's been doing a really good job with price matching, especially for the holidays this year. So sometimes it's just easier to order it off Amazon, especially depending on where you're at if you don't have quick access to be able to go somewhere like Walmart or Target. So, um, but they've been doing a good job with shipping. Mm -hmm. So if you order here soon, you should still be able to get everything in time for Christmas. Mm -hmm. So Wally, what's your favorite learning toy? Um, the toad puppy. You like the coding toad puppy. puppy. That one's really cool. That one is really yeah. fun. Oh, yeah. Well, my favorite one to do with Wally is the Osmo board. It's so much fun like to see to all the different it. activities. You, you like, like to color, color with it? Yeah. yeah. It's really fun. It has a lot of things that you can do with it. And there's a lot of other apps too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you really like to color. It's cool to see your drawings come to life, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, yeah. Yeah. Eddie it's so cool. <laughs> Everything is so cool. Well, I really like, I like the acorns and the scale, and while well, sometimes it's a little frustrating with him, he's still learning with it. I think they're great tools, and I really like that they can scaffold okay. for a long time. So he's gonna be able to use those for a long time. There's lots of fun ways we can use them when we start learning to spell out words and things like that, um, and just doing like some math and equations and stuff. So I think those are great tools to start planting the seeds with that and just having lots of fun. All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this gave you guys some good last minute gift ideas either for Christmas or maybe upcoming birthdays or other holidays. Yeah. We have a lot of fun with these toys yeah. and we hope you guys enjoy them too. And if you end up getting any or you maybe have some other ones that we may have missed and we should feature in a future video, Leave that down in the comments below. Yeah, we're always looking for learning toys, or at least I am anyway. I love, I'm like a learning toy junkie. Yeah. I love it, so. And while you're down there, hit that thumbs up button. Let us know you liked the video. Hit that subscribe button and bell icon so you know when we have the next video out. This is the wonderful world of Walter. And we love you just the way you are. Bye. Bye.